Imagine this, a massive former airliner lumbering through smoky skies, its cabin crammed with tens of thousands of gallons of water to be dumped on raging wildfires below. Unreal, right? But believe it or not, the venerable McDonnell Douglas N-87 has been remarkably transformed into a heavy-duty firefighter, its passenger seats replaced with a voluminous water tank. This heroic rebirth is thanks to the innovation of specialty aviation firms seeking to repurpose obsolete 8787 airliners. Originally designed in the 1980s as a workhorse medium-range twin jet, the med seven crisscrossed continents for decades as a mainstay of many airline fleets. But eventually, airlines replaced these aging planes with more efficient modern jets. This left dozens of experienced but outdated Met 87s on the second-hand market, too young to retire but too outdated to fly profitably. Sensing opportunity, some ingenious companies scooped up these dirt-cheap airliners and undertook the challenging conversion into firefighting tankers. This extensive modification involved gutting the entire passenger cabin to install a gigantic interior water tank. Stripped of seats and fittings, the A-87's floor became a cavernous tank able to hold an astonishing 10,000 gallons of water, nearly triple the capacity of standard firefighting air tankers. Additional water tanks were even fitted inside the wings for extra capacity. To handle the tremendous water weight, engineers reinforced the Med-87's airframe, wings, and landing gear. While no longer carrying passengers, this gave the aircraft the ruggedness to operate heavily laden from primitive airfields near wildfires. A specialized computerized tank and release apparatus was installed to strategically dump water on burn zones. At 300 miles per hour and low altitude, the ND-87 can saturate mile-long fire fronts by dropping thousands of gallons in precise patterns across targeted areas. The tanks can be refilled in just 12 minutes. On a typical fire mission, the Mate 87 might dump up to six tank loads, allowing flexible ground, directed bombing runs. With such tremendous water delivery, just one and 87 has the fire-suppressing strength of multiple standard tankers. Though not as agile as purpose-built water bombers, the MD-87's enormous capacity and ability to accurately deluge hotspots makes it an extremely formidable firefighting machine. It's unbelievable that a retired 150-seat airliner has taken on an amazing second life combating flames from the sky. Repurposing decommissioned airliners as giant fire trucks makes practical and financial sense, too. Acquiring used Meat 87s is far cheaper than custom new water bombers, offsetting their higher maintenance costs. It's like purchasing a pre-owned vehicle instead of new. In the end, innovation and creativity have transformed an ordinary medium-range airliner into the unlikely firefighting hero that is the massive Edding 87 tanker. Scrambling to wildfires, this improbable aviation phoenix courageously battles the infernos, deploying its voluminous former passenger cabin filled with thousands of gallons of life, giving water. What an inspirational second chapter for these retired jets. Let me know if you want to see more videos on converted aircraft. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next video.